See this picture behind me? That is a brain in a petri dish and that is exactly what scientists have created. That's right, they use skin cells to create a fetus sized brain and it is a pretty remarkable discovery. Over the last 12 weeks, Ohio State University researchers have grown an unconscious brain equivalent to that of a five week old fetus by converting adult skin cells into a type of cell called a pluripotent cell. Now, if you don't know this, a pluripotent cell is a type of cell that with the right stimulation is an immature stem cell that can become any kind of tissue present in the human body. Now this includes both neural and brain tissue and that is the impetus behind this discovery. So previous attempts they'd done pretty well but they struggled and kind of created these incomplete cerebral organoids which had the development of a nine week old fetus but they were only kind of able to develop certain parts of the brain. Now what's different about this new discovery is this brain is about 99% of the genes expressed in a fully formed adult brain, including the spinal cord, the retina, and all of the other major brain regions that you would expect. Now this is pretty insane stuff. Now while it lacks a blood supply, which is developed after the fifth gestational week, and it has no sensory input, it means that the lab-grown brain is basically not thinking in any way, right? So clearly this is gonna upset a lot of people, um, people that are worried about stem cell research. But listen, this is one of the biggest breakthroughs that have happened in a long time, okay? So what's so important about this? Fetal t tissue research has had a very important past. It's led to the development of the chickenpox, polio, and the rubella vac vaccines. Mind you, the rubella vaccine has curbed more than 5,000 miscarriages yearly caused by rubella bacterial infections. So this is a massive discovery. We will be reporting more on the Fowler Show and let you know how this brain turns out.